My grandson's tent broke, the dowel rod snapped in half, but I'm gonna fix it with my portable Fabricator Mini 3D printer, right here at Filament Friday. Filament Friday is brought to you by the generous donations of these Patreon supporters. I love my little Fabricator Mini. I've had this thing for like seven years. It fits in this case so I can haul it around to anywhere I need. It's great for taking to shows or to my grandson's house to fix his tent. So I just set it up. I'm going to print with some PLA, plug in the power pack, and this thing's ready to go. But now we can design a little piece to fix the dowel rod. I go to Tinkercad. I'm going to make a hole, which is 20 millimeters, and the outer ring, 25 millimeters, bring them together, group them, and now I have my coupling to fix the dowel rods. So let's export this as a .stl file. I'll bring it into Cura 5.1. I'm going to select the Fabricator Mini Profile, which is actually part of Cura. I'm going to use the draft mode, which is a 0.3 layer height. And this thing's going to be rough, but that's what I want. So it grips the dowel rod. 37 minutes to print it. I'll save the G-code file to an SD card, slip it into the printer. And then we'll select Print from SD. Select the file, which I called TP. Click on it, and this thing will start heating up pretty quickly. It's going to home and then go right to 200 degrees. There's no bed to heat up because this doesn't have a heated bed. And this thing starts printing right away. The print is done so I can pop it off the bed. It's got a random seam so it's pretty rough on the outside and actually a little bit on the inside, but that's good because it's gonna grip the dowel rod. I have to really twist this to get it on. Now the bottom section seemed to go in a little bit easier up to a point, and then I had to push both ends together to get it nice and tight. Once that was done, I could set the TP up so it's ready for my grandson to play. 3D printing to the rescue. If you like what I'm doing here, maybe check out some of the other videos popping up. If you want to help support the channel, Patreon is one way. And if nothing else, click on that Filament Friday logo and subscribe. I'll see you next time, right here at Filament Friday.